guys, it's me, Brandy. I am going to go over my Juvia's Place palettes with you. I've got all of them right here. And I'm going to do a ranking video from last to first. And yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that with you guys here. Uh, right now so I gotta flip them over carefully very carefully all right so last place and uh, I'm gonna give a little um, some of these I haven't used so I'm ranking it a lot of them based on the colors and just if I think I'm going to use them or not so I've got the Nubian 2 by Juvia's, and I'm ranking this last, not because I don't like it, I think it's beautiful. I just have a lot of palettes, and I just wanna go ahead and swatch this one, it's called Egypt. And I'll just put that right there. That green is gorgeous. So this may be ranked last, but that doesn't mean that anything. And then this is like a deep purple, and then this is called Layla. Look at that. Those are beautiful. So, like, I love all of my Juvia's Place palettes. Um, I will, even when I do my declutter video, I will not be getting rid of any of them because I love them. I love Juvia's Place um, formula. It's amazing. All right. So, this is the Festival by Juvia's. And I just love the artwork, it's so pretty. And this is what that one looks like. I will swatch, let's see how I'll swatch Uli, which is this is really beautiful um, white. And I'll do Abba, which they're both beautiful. There's Uli, and then Abba gorgeous and then this one is the warrior by Juvia's this one I have used I do like it um, again I like all of them uh, this one reminds me of the Too Faced the Too Faced the Sweet Peach palette but that reminds me of that. So that is what the Warrior 2 is. And that is number, so that is number 12. And then this one, I have not done a look on my channel yet. I haven't, I have swatched it. And that is about it. This is what the inside looks like. It is beautiful. I don't know if I love that Juvia's did um, smaller pans, but they've got this duochrome in there. And I feel like just for that duochrome, it's worth it. Get that on my finger. It's so pretty. I cannot wait to do a look with this palette. Um, I have a lot of looks planned. I think I'm gonna try to film every single morning until Christmas, and then I will, um, I'll film every morning, and then I will edit every night, just so that I have everything that I wanted done. This one, I'm only gonna rank it number 11, and the only reason why is because I haven't used it on my channel yet. I'm ranking it higher than the other ones because I love the color story of that palette. Uh, next we have the Afrique. Um, this is a very old palette. I love this palette. This red is beautiful. And then I also love, I'll do the screen. They're both gorgeous. So the Afrique is number 10. Look at that red. That's beautiful. 
so pretty. All right, and then number nine is going to be the Saharan, which is another palette that I absolutely love. And my two favorite shades in this palette is Iman. It's this silvery white. And I'll say Zoya, which is like a peachy rose goldy color. I kind of swatched that on top of each other, but. So that was number eight. And then number seven is the Nubian and Coral palette. I absolutely love this palette. I've used it a couple of times. Um, let's see, and I've got, I'm gonna swatch this brown. And then I'll swatch this peach color and it's like a burnt peach maybe get that brown so pretty that was number seven and we have number six is my Juvia's Place Walhalla palette this I have done several looks with and I've also showcased it on my on my uh, Instagram. This one down there in the corner is a duochrome. I love that. And then I will swatch this super um, flaky purple. So we've got that one. And then that pretty like purpley color. Ooh, so pretty. All right, so number six is my Zulu palette. And I feel like this is um, a different take on a rainbow palette, but I love that bright green. And I also love this aqua color. So I'll put those two. And then my fifth place is the Deuce. And I absolutely love this palette. I've done so many looks with it. Um, I've got this white duochrome look, this white uh, duochrome here. And then this really pretty, I want to say it's like a silver. Now number four is the Queen um, Boomy Times Juvia's Place palette. And I know this is a face palette, but I use it for um, highlight. And then I do use this one for blush, but I also use it as an eyeshadow palette. So it is with my eyeshadow palettes. And my favorite here is Glam and FDV Approved. So I will put Let's see if I can get it on here. Glam. And F, that is a beautiful highlight. I don't know if you have that palette, you should try it. It's a beautiful highlight. All right, so now my third place palette is the Masquerade Mini. This is one of my first ones. And I absolutely love this green. And I also love this purple. They're so pretty. I love that that palette is like both grungy and, or not grungy, neutral and colorful. All right, so I'm gonna put one there and then one there. That purple is like insane. All right, so my number two palette is the Tribe palette. Absolutely love this palette. Um, it's well loved. I have done several looks with this palette. My two favorite shades is Curla and Kuba. Those two. 
I'll put those one there. And then one here. They are just so beautiful. Um, I love how this is like a grungy palette, but it has like this pop of um, like this bright greeny yellow or yellowy green. I don't know where to put this, so you can see that right there. It's just so pretty. And then my number one favorite palette of all time from Juvia's. I'm dropping them. Don't drop them. Is the Magic Mini palette. And this was my first purchase from Juvia's. And let's see, my favorite shades in here is Fausto. It's like this beautiful, like duochrome purple. And then I have Aja, which is, is like a dark, dark blue. And then we'll do Buzo, which is a green. I don't know if you're seeing a theme here, but I like specific colors. So those are all of my favorite Juvia's Place palettes. Magic Mini being number one. Um, so yeah, please let me know um, if I picked your favorite for my favorite down below. And again, the order that I had these in doesn't actually mean anything because I love all of my Juvia's Place palettes um, equally. Uh, thank you so much for watching with me today. Please do me a favor and like this video down below, comment also, and subscribe if you haven't already. And then also, if you would do me a favor, please go follow me over on Instagram and uh, at Brandywine13. Thank you so much and have a great night. Bye.